Meanwhile, we have to admit basic essentials like soap, a toothbrush, and even an ID card are all taken for granted. A woman from Granite Bay is collecting these items and putting them in a purse to give to sex trafficking survivors. Ananda Rochita shows us how she's helping hundreds of victims. A lotion, shampoo, conditioner, and some soap. When we collected 650 purses, it's kind of a need to make sure that we have enough stuff in them. Julie Nakayama shows me around her living room filled with dozens of purses. Two years ago in 2015, I saw a Facebook post that went viral talking about if you have any extra purses, next time you see a homeless lady, you know, fill it with essential items. I figured, you know, at that point I had about 15 purses in the back of my closet. And I had a lot of bathroom toiletry items. And I figured, you know, there's really no lack of empty purses in Sacramento and there is a need for them to go to people that don't have those items. And you just zip this right up? Yep, and so that goes in the purse, so nothing leaks in the purses. In two years, she went from collecting 75 the first year to now 650 purses. Social media is pretty much how I've done every part of this project, from finding people around town that are willing to be drop-off spots for me to having it shared on Facebook. She's donating them to organizations like Blue Heart International, which works with sex trafficking survivors. How grateful are these women for something as simple as a purse? So sometimes we get women that cry. We met a woman on the street and she said in the 20 years that she's been walking the street, she's never met anyone that cared. She's only met people that have actually sold her and have wanted to buy her. Julie spends a majority of her day organizing purses and essential items, but at home, she's also a mom. Who does mommy give the purses to? Because I want my boys to know that kindness of strangers is important and it's not all about you and you know, there's a lot of people we can help in this world. Well, I mean, in Granite Bay and on the Rochita, ABC 10 News. What an important campaign it is a day of giving, so of course always important to give back, but such an important topic at this time. And Liz, listen to this. We're told inside every purse is a note that reads, I care about your situation, I wish you peace, safety, mm -hmm. and the kindness of strangers.